ShipStation tutorial, how to get started with ShipStation for beginners. Hi there, welcome to our channel and for today's video, I will show you a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to get started with ShipStation for beginners. ShipStation is a shipping platform that allows you to manage all your small parcel and e-commerce fulfillment. So if you want to start using this platform to fulfill your customers' orders, then this video is perfect for you. So without further ado, let's get started. So first, visit their site at ShipStation.com and this is the main homepage of this software. And with this software, you can easily connect your selling channels like Shopify, WooCommerce, eBay, Etsy, and more. And also, you can connect different carriers for shipping like DHL, UPS, FedEx, and many more. And this software also provides different features, not just shipping, but also order management, branding, from having customized email to tracking page and more. You can provide an exceptional and consistent visual identity for your customers and your brand. You may also have inventory management and lastly integration and partner. So wherever you sell, however you ship, ShipStation will power up your shipping. You can easily connect ShipStation to online stores, marketplaces, careers, and e-commerce tools in seconds and seamlessly sync your shipping. So before we start creating an account here, let's first check the pricing just for us to have an idea of how much it will cost us to use this software. And if you haven't checked this one yet, just go to pricing. And here they have six different plans to choose from. They don't have any free plan, but for new users, you can have a free trial. So the cheapest plan here is the starter for $9.99 per month. And with this plan, you'll get 50 shipments per month, one users, branded labels and packing slips, and email and community forum support. Next is the Browns plan for $29.99 and you get 500 shipments per month. Then silver plan for $49.99 per month and from this plan you'll get 1,500 shipments plus you can have two users and customized labels and packing slips. The gold plan is their most popular plan for $69.99 and you'll get up to 3,000 shipments and can have three users. Next is the platinum for $99.99. You'll have up to 6,000 shipments per month and also five users. And lastly, the enterprise plan for $159.99 per month. It's perfect for up to 10,000 shipments per month and 10 users. And if you have over 10,000 shipments for a month or per month, you may contact their sales team for assistance. So here, let's get started by creating an account for us to show you how you get started here on ShipStation. So just click here, try it free button. Here you can have 30 days free trial and no credit card needed. And to create an account, just fill out this form with your name, email, country, company, and how did you hear about this software. Once done, just click on continue. Then provide your phone number here and number of shipment per month and also create your own password. And then don't forget to check the I read and agree to term box here and click on get started. And after that, just log in to your account here. So by the way, how this software works. So here's the illustration showing how it works. So here first you import your products like connecting your selling store like Shopify, WooCommerce, eBay, and other online store. And after you connect your online store, then all your orders from your online site will be imported to ShipStation and it's where they will manage your order. And then you can create your shipping labels. And lastly, you can set automate updates like send email to your customers to track their package or send your customer a link for them to click and see the package updates. So this software will not manage or keep your physical products, but they will just help you with the logistic or shipping of the products and create labels for your customer. So for this tutorial video for beginners, I will just show you how you get started, like set up your account and import products. So let's begin. 
So after you log in, this is the dashboard. But if you are a new user, your dashboard will show some welcome page and guide on how you can set up everything here in ShipStation. So from here, the first thing that we need to do is to connect our selling channels. So from dashboard, you can go to account settings up here on your top right corner and here click on selling channels and click on store setup. So here you have option to connect your store or marketplace. So just click on it and here you'll see a different store. Just choose your online store, for example, Shopify here. So from here, just provide your Shopify store domain. And after that, click connect. Let's try the other store, like for example, Big Commerce. They have a different guide as well for this store. So not all store here have the same step to connect your store, but ShipStation will give you a guide on how you can integrate your store here. So there is no need for you to worry about. After you can connect your store, you'll be prompted to this page. Here you can name your store and here you can set your store active or not. You can also set up your branding here. This is important to set up because this will be used on your packing slips, custom tracking pages, and shipment notification emails. Also, you can set up your tracking pages here, notifications, packing slips, and so on. The next thing that we can do here is choosing your career. So ShipStation has many career partners. So go to shipping and select careers and fulfillment. Then here, select add providers, and you'll see the different career providers here, and it will depend on which country you are from. But for this one, it's in the U.S., so just select the career and connect your account, or you can simply create an account. No worries, this software will also guide you, so let me skip and let move on to setting up your printing for your labels. So here under printing, click on printing setup and you can set up your labels layout here and more. So just click on document option and select a format. And after that, you can enter some information here that needed, then save it. The next thing you can set for beginners is your shipping from location. So go back to your shipping and click on shipping from location. And then just add your location here if where the product came from. And lastly, I will show you how you can import your order here from your online store. So just click on order up here and go to awaiting shipment. So now as you can see here, we don't have any order yet imported. So to import some order from your top right corner, just click on this update icon. And here you can select update all store if you have multiple store here and you want to update. Or you can simply import order manually, just select the store name here. So once you click on update, all your order from your store will be imported here in ShipStation. As you can see here, there are three order from our store now imported inside this software. And no worries guys, because you can also set up the auto update. So there's no need for you to manually click the update button time to time to update your order. Just go back to your settings again up here and go to selling channels and store setup. And here you can check this allow this store to update periodically. So just enable it. And with that time to time, it will automatically update or import your order from your store here in your ship station. So I guess that's all for today's video. And if you have any question, guys, just comment down below. And thank you so much for watching.